guys it's another saturday and welcome back to another new vlog so apparently i've been napping and i've napped from around three to five i've woken like five ten so i want to have my lunch what i've done is i've ordered i've ordered from chicken in so i've gotten a i've dialed a delivery gotten a rider they've brought the meal and i've cooked some tea as usual and as you can hear guys i have i have this flu that that won't go away i don't know i've tried every remedy i've tried making dawa i've tried taking medicine i don't know what it wants but i hope you guys are okay i'm happy to start another new vlog and i'm hoping that it will be a good one this is the meal in question i've just ordered a one pizza and have cooked some tea i've already started munching on them so let me munch on that as i decide whether i'm going to watch an arsenal match that is happening right now because i'm a lover of football So apparently I'm sitting in the dark because Kenya Power has decided we have to sleep early. So I have just finished cooking. I was also doing dishes. It feels so cold. I've actually gotten myself a, a duvet. And I'm going to sit here for a while as I wait for the lights to come back on. I'm not that hungry, so I don't think I'll be eating again. I'll just chill here for a while, then I go sleep. So this was on a Sunday after church. We decided to head out for a road trip to Narok. And those are my friends. That's my husband there. That is Damaris from the Fall Right. Then she caught then Jennifer. So we headed out to to Narok, we wanted to get to the, that was our final destination and we we experienced very beautiful sceneries we also stopped over at uh, what's this called the Rift Valley viewpoint and we took some pictures and some videos before we proceeded with the journey So we finally arrived in Narok. It's a cool town, very, very calm, very good. And the people there were so friendly. We also stopped over to get some lunch and we had some meat. We did a tumbukiza and a choma. So after lunch, we visited our sister-in-law. Then we started our journey back to Nairobi because we are also going to other places and it was a smooth journey. We thank God for journey masses and we went to proceed with the other activities of the night. 
So we went to 254. It's in Kikuyu. For those who know the place, it's around Le Villa. And uh, Man City were playing with Chelsea. So we were enjoying the match as we also had our drinks. That is my friend Damathia. That is Jennifer. <laughs> Yeah, so it was such a good day and it was such a vibe. Good morning guys, so it's on a Tuesday morning and I've just woken up. I want to shower and uh, prepare breakfast and head out to work. Yesterday was a holiday, the weekend was long but we had so much fun but today we resume work so i'll be taking you guys along and i'm hoping that you guys are okay and that you're doing well so i'm already done i've showered <coughs> sorry i want to 
I'm cooking the tea and I'll be warming this uh, fries and uh, fish that we got yesterday. Uh, mine I had some leftovers, that is what I'll be eating with, with some tea when I head out for work. So I'll be taking you guys along. Let me warm them in the microwave and they will be good to go. This was on the next day and I was cooking some kiveri for lunch. Yeah, we normally like having the kiveri most of the times during lunch time. And uh, we were chilling with my husband. <laughs> yeah, he was camera shy. <laughs> Hi guys, it's actually Wednesday, Wednesday night, and I'm preparing dinner. So today I'm cooking jahe with rice. So I've decided to add in some beef to just make it more better. So I'm boiling the meat. Then to add in more flavor, I will be adding in some grated carrots. I discovered the secret to making jahe tastes even more better is adding grated carrots not just little but like do many carrots so, but not so many yeah so let me do that and i will be showing you guys the outcome hi guys so welcome back again to my channel it's on a thursday evening and uh, i want to prepare dinner today we are doing ugali and uh, cabbage with some beef yeah so i've just come from a run today we substituted our taekwondo classes with a run and uh, we've decided we'll do it tomorrow again <sighs> But I've just showered, so I want to prepare dinner so that I can rest early. So tomorrow we are going to be picking my small sister from school. She's finishing her secondary education tomorrow. And I'm so excited about that. But we'll be picking her and we need to wake up early because we will be going to work first. Then we head out to pick up from school yeah so i hope you guys are doing well i'll be taking you guys along peace hi guys so it's on a friday morning and we are already on our way to pick up my sister yeah small sister <laughs> small sister and uh, the journey has been fine so far so it's not cold today, it's, the weather is good and I'll be taking you guys along. Hi guys, so we've decided to stop over at a place called, do you know the place? Yes. <laughs> what is the name? According to the that post there. So we'll be having some meat before we proceed. Yeah. <laughs> this is what you've gotten. These are it's a kg. Yeah, 
or 1.5 with some ugali yeah <laughs> it's so it's nine and you're already eating our lunch and it is not expensive yeah it's not expensive we bought it at our actually the area is called saba saba So we are already here. We've already gotten to the school. Let me pick up my sister. I'll catch up with you guys. guys to Mefika but then I think she's in the second shift they're doing their biology practicals so to Mema took chill apa kwa gari kwa boot tutaki atoke atukose eh ninajua vile mtu anakuanga igaki kumaliza shule 